Hey, this is Ralph, and in this video, I want to show you how you can use the loading attribute for your image tags along with a lazy value in order to delay the loading of images. So what this means is, is we will be delaying loading of images until the user is going to get to a point to where they can see them. Let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. So I've got a page already started here, nothing too exciting on it, but I do happen to have five photos on there. and. I've made these images into block and I've given them all a really big margin top of a thousand pixels. That means they're all going to be spaced really far apart from each other and the user is not going to see them when they first go to the web page. Hence, all of my images are below the fold. Above the fold content is what the user sees right when they first go to that web page. So let's see what's going on with this. Now, in order to test this out, I do need to, to quickly publish. So I've got my FTP program off to the side upload that and then I'm gonna head over to my Firefox developer edition here and I got a web page open on the left don't worry about that one and I've got the images network console off to the right now to really test this out I'm gonna go ahead and clear out my cache so let's see I'll just jump over to settings in Firefox all browsers should be able to do this privacy and settings clear data and I want to clear web content image content basically now check this out I'm gonna to go to that web page and it's lazy loading number one dot html and watch over here in the um, console to the right now you'll notice that all five of my images loaded up right away along with my little favicon image there and if i scroll down on my page there we go there are all those images displayed with those big margin tops now this is what's happening by default all five of these big images are loading up as soon as the visitor gets to that web page, even though the visitor is not scrolling down to a point to where they can even look at those images. So it's kind of pushing all of that data right there early on. Now let's change this up a bit. I'm gonna jump back to just a generic note page here. And on this web page, I'm gonna go ahead and put in loading equals lazy and I'm going to do this for each of my images cool and let's see I'll go ahead and uh, file save as let's just go ahead and save this as lazy loading number two yes I'll overwrite that's fine I'm gonna make sure that I publish to the server I'm going to jump back over to my Firefox browser and again let me go ahead and clear the cache so we're getting a really fresh experiment with this. So let's see, I need to go over to settings, privacy, clear data, I just want to clear out my cached web content, perfect. Now check this out, I'm going to head over to my other page, Lazy, Lazy Loading 2, which remember has the loading lazy attribute value. Okay, so I go to this page and I'm there. It's loaded up, but notice on my images, the only image that is showing up that has been loaded so far is my little favicon, little, little baby image up there in the browser tab. We don't see any of those bigger cafe pictures. Now watch as I slowly scroll down on this web page. There's cafe number one. Cafe one has loaded into the browser, into the cache, even though the user hasn't gotten there, but they're getting close. And there's my cafe one picture, woman drinking some coffee. And then I keep scrolling down. And at some point I'm going to get to, ah, my cafe two picture has loaded up. Keep scrolling down. Cafe three is loading up. So we're delaying the loading of these images until the user is more inclined to interact with them, kind of spreading out that load and not wasting any of the data. If the user is not going to scroll down and see those images, why take the hit on the server? Why take the hit on the data plans and things like that? So I want you to start considering using this loading attribute. And you're going to put this on images that are definitely below the fold. No need to put it on your logos and things like that. Your business logos are going to be right there at the top of the page above the fold. Instead, you want to put it on that bigger image content that's further down on your pages. So there we go. So loading equals lazy. Still relatively new. It's got pretty good support. It may not work in all browsers, but it should work in most modern browsers. So um, get to it. Thanks for hanging out with me.